Hi friends, Jimmy Biggs here at Crow Creek Golf Club and last month you got to see what I do in the pro shop but uh, it's been a month I want you to see kind of what we're doing out here on the golf course. Uh, see what's going on with the greens, see what's going on with the tees and maybe a few other things. Let's go check it out. Alright, well first thing first, we're out here behind the clubhouse at our, uh, our practice green and we're on about day 10 of growing this green in. We just seeded them uh, the Friday before last and as you can see in there we got a little bit of a green fuzz coming in so that's very exciting that's very, we're very optimistic about it uh, now what we'll do what, during this process is try to keep these things steadily watered we actually really want to keep them cool in the, uh, during the daytime obviously the the summer heat isn't ideal but uh, if we can keep these things cool give them plenty of water they'll grow up just fine in the summertime we don't have to worry about watering down golfers out here while we're doing it the other exciting thing we got going right now is we actually created a bigger collar. All right, in years past we've always had a just a basic two-foot collar, and the problem with that was is if you knock it on the green, sometimes you get that that ball that was right up against the edge of the rough and the collar. So what we did is we expanded that, and what'll be really exciting is in the winter time when this Bermuda grass goes dormant, uh, is we we'll actually have a nice little outline of the green from the fairway so whether you're 100 out or 200 out you're going to see a nice defined edge of the green which you think will be very very interesting looking while you're out there playing. Well now we've come inside to the clubhouse here and as you can see we've actually revamped everything. We've repainted all the walls, new trim, brand new carpet. Uh, we had a a lot of traffic in here over the years, so obviously you can imagine the wear and tear, but beautiful new carpet. Uh, still got the nice little living room set up over here. Uh, as you can see, our guy over here is refinishing all the doors. Actually really happy with everything that's come out so far. Uh, I'll tell you something that's really exciting and what the golfers are really going to appreciate is behind the bar. We're about to throw in a whole new beer tap system. So. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what kind of beer it is yet because I get the taste test at all. And we'll do that next month, me taste testing a bunch of beer. But check it out. Here's our system right here. This thing's going in. This is going to look super sharp uh, in all my favorite flavors probably because that's all that matters is what I think. Uh, but that'll be going in later on this week. Uh, so next month you'll be able to check that out. Uh, this is what the behind the bar looks like. This is where I don't get to come back to too often. Luckily, that's why we're closed right now, but it'll be open next week. Let's go check out some more stuff. All right, we're out here on the 18th green now, and uh, what I wanted to show you is kind of the great sod work our crew has done out here. You know, obviously, when we went out here and reshaped a lot of these greens, we have a lot of heavy machinery, and they tear up some earth. So what we've done is we've cleared off about a good 12-foot section on, around every green, and re-leveled it, recontour it, so we make sure A, the water gets off the green so it won't cause any problems while it's on there, and B, uh, so we can re-level everything off and then make it nice and tight when the golf course does open back up. So right now you can see all the fresh sod work. You can come over here, they're actually finishing up this green right now. So this is what it looked like prior to putting in the new sod. Now in two months time, you won't even be able to tell that this sod was laid. Everything will be nice and tight and uniform. This Bermuda grass right now in the summertime grows like a weed. You can't stop it from growing. It grows like crazy. So once this gets all tied in, pretty soon it'll be just as flush with the fairway like everything else. We're out here on number 10 tee box, and actually this is a new tee box for us out here at Crow. Uh, this one's going to sit about 260 from the green. Uh, I know a lot of my ladies golf association is going to be very happy about this. Uh, one, of a, one of the knocks we heard while we were open is that some of the ladies' tees were maybe a, a hair too long. So what we've done is actually move up a few tees. This is actually one of 17 tees that we've built while we're down. Uh, this one hasn't been sodded yet. It will shortly. Uh, but again, you've got a, a great straight-in shot. It doesn't look like it's you know, just an afterthought. This is a built-up tee box, beautiful shot. Uh, I think our ladies are really going to enjoy it. Uh, one of the biggest things I think... Uh, that's exciting and in addition to the ladies tees we've also added some back tees some way back tees and I'm gonna go show you one here shortly we're out here on number 13 tee box now this is a beautiful par 3 every one of you have probably seen it when you've driven by uh, it's about 171 yards from the back tee right now and again you've got a little peninsula green out there beautiful bulkhead water yeah you know what we figured yeah this isn't easy this is too easy let's make it harder let's make it a lot harder 
How about this for a tee box? Yeah, we figure from back here you're looking at about 190 to 195. Um, I'm a little scared of this tee, but I like it. You know, it's exciting. I'll never have to play back here, hopefully. Uh, but we think some of our tour players would love it. All right, now we're out here on 13 green. We just left the tee box. What I think is so cool about this one, we've added a tee, but we've added a back tee to the next hole. So as you walk off number 13, you know, you just finished a good par three, probably 190 yarder, and now you're walking one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten steps, and guess what, folks? You're on the next tee, number 14. I wouldn't be surprised if this is going to be the number one handicap for this side. You're looking at almost 500 yards, par four. That's right, I said par four. Going to be a bear. This one's going to be long. All right, friends, I hope you, hopefully you enjoyed the tour today. Uh, if you want to see some more updates on how we're doing, you can go to crowcreekgolf.com or you can go to our Facebook page or by all means call me Monday through Friday, 877-287-3081. There'll be someone here in the pro shop. By the time you see this video, the restaurant should be open again. You can come have lunch. You can buy me lunch. I love lunch. Obviously, I love lunch. We'd love to see you. Come check us out. Crow Creek Golf. Love you guys. See you soon.